Hey yo, Mambo Vipi man, it's your boy Ben C. You can call me the two ninja. Good, good, wonderful, good evening to you. You are watching us from Wapi, Mama Wapi. But I want you guys to tell me where you are watching us from. You want to engage because today we have an amazing show. We have a lady to this. Like that. <clears throat> We're going to have an amazing show. Thank you so much for joining us. Nataka to Jibambe to have fun. This is the only art show where you get entertained and, and you get to learn. So, let me make sure we are going to have a really good time. But anyway, before we go, we get into his or fun moments, I want to teach you something about an amazing artist that I have been introduced to <laughs> by our guests today. Uh, so, his name is Fabiano Milan. He was born in 1981. <clears throat> he started his career in visual arts at the same time in, uh, uh, in which he, he first taught a course on drawing in the city of Santo, An San Santo Angelo. <laughs> mm, so Milan began his career uh, in 1997 when he took a course in artistic drawing. Yeah? <clears throat> so, after before I go into the details, what I'm watching the rest of you, go Google him, find out more about him. So make sure you go check out Ujama. Now, uh, the point of me telling you about this guy is because whatever uh, creative form of art you're doing, make sure you just keep it because Mazen you never know. You may do a uh, drawing leo, maybe when you do a ama you might do a dance choreography leo, how you dance, ama you might do a music, whatever today, and it, uh, to you it may not have an impact. But years to come, you never know. And then he has a change world, he has a change like here, yeah, so he has a change uh, history. Yeah. So whatever it is that you do, make sure you do it with passion. Give it 101% and trust me, the time will come when everything will unveil and it will be awesome. But anyway, um, we have an amazing show like, lined up for you. And make sure Mazel will stick around for the next 30 minutes and be your pilot. <laughs> so tell me whatever it is you want us to uh, talk about. Talk to your story all the way in Pakari. So, uh, after this break, I will introduce you guys to the amazing guest we have today. So, see you after the break. See you after the break. Everywhere, GBS. Welcome back, Maze. Welcome back, welcome back. Thank you for sti sticking with us. Uh, you are amazing because today, today I want to show you how amazing you are. But if, before we get into that, watch this Kubambe sana. Take it slow. I want to introduce you guys to our guest today. Are you ready, boys and girls? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I just want her to introduce herself so that we see, we see overdue. I don't want to overdue. I don't want to underdo. So, yes. <laughs> I don't want to. I don't want to overdo. Yeah, okay. And then to do that for career, you may let up. But anyway, you know, camera, I could just introduce yourself. Okay, uh, my name is Pascaline Jabet. I am a high fashion model. I do art, and other than that, I do dance a lot most of the time. And uh, the most interesting part is I run a kids agency called Little Miss Universe Kenya on East Africa Kids Fashion Week and I'm the chief editor for East Africa Kids Fashion Magazine. Ooh! Yes. Fancy! We so, have an amazing person. Leo ni mwaletea ni wakila kitu. She's a fashion designer. Wait. No. Let's go slow. Okay, start from the model. beginning. Yeah, I'm a model. Model. Uh, 
I do art. You do art, yes. I dance a little bit. A little bit, so after the show you're going to... No! <laughs> that wasn't on the schedule. <laughs> <laughs> you will squeeze it in. Uh -huh. Yeah, and uh, I do write a magazine for kids. Yes. Yes. It's called uh, East Africa Kids Fashion Magazine. Oh, fantastic. Yeah, and then I run a company for kids for fashion. Where? Five hats. Six. It's five. Six. I don't know. Six. <laughs> Hats. Uh, Tell me, how do you juggle between six hats? Uh, when I'm not doing uh, the, the fashion part, mm -hmm. I'm mostly drawing and I do my artworks mostly from 2 p.m. to midnight. From 2 p.m. specifically? It's not like specific every day, but in the time you feel like. Eh. Upon your. Masa. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but not every day. Yeah. It's mostly when I am around home. That's home. when I do art. Yes. Okay, you are home, but when you are away? Uh, it's mostly the fashion, mm. training the kids. Yeah. yeah. Let me just ask, out of these, is it to Zote Sita? Mm. Which is your favorite? Uh, art. Art? Yes. Zote ni art? Okay, uh, painting. Painting is yes. your favorite. Because? Because uh, it's something that I, I, ne I never knew I could do. Mm -hmm. And then when I realized I can do it, mm. it went overboard. <laughs> so let me just ask. Yeah. If I told you today, mm -hmm. you're going to, you, you need to, you have to, you have to quit everything else mm -hmm. and do art and do this, draw. Or you quit drawing and do everything else. I'd rather quit everything else and do art. Wow! So let me just ask <laughs> I want you to, uh, these are some of our work, by the way. Let me bring it closer so that you can get, you guys can see. Can you see? Can you see it? It's amazing. Uh, I'll be posting them on my social media as well because I want you guys to see them. Um, for you to complete this, how long does it take? One hour, maximum two. Two hours? Yeah. What do you need to start? I need a canvas mm -hmm. and the Okay, first you need the canvas and then prime it. Yes. After priming it, you do the sketch. Yes. After the sketch, now you just paint. The easiest part of it is painting. The hardest part is sketching. So when you say sketch, you take like a pencil? Or yes, a pencil ruler. Mm -hmm. a I, ruler? Yeah. Okay. I do more of magnification because I use my phone. Oh, okay. So the exact thing that's on my phone, yeah. magnify it to that size. So you use a ruler for that? Yes. Where? <laughs> Sounds like hard work. I don't want to see it's just what you do your thing. It's magnification in math. But if it takes you an hour to complete this whole thing, mm. in a day, how many paintings can you do? I, maximum four. But I usually put myself to three paintings per day. Because it's like a kovado. How long is the game? By the time I'm doing the last one, I'm actually very exhausted. Okay. So usually at least three. Three at most. At I most. Yes. Hey, that I mean but could have the other paintings like portraits takes like two days to three days. So you're always the fourth. Mm. Ah. Yeah. But yeah. the easy ones like this one, just you can do three of them. Which is the most complicated thing you've ever tried? Hey, 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 hey. I did a string art for... Wait, huh? wait, wait, wait. You do string art as well? Yes. He? Madam, what don't you do? But that's what I started with before I did. Oh, okay. So I did a string art for President uh, Uhuru's portrait. Mm -hmm. And then there's one for Obama and then there's one for Jomo Kenyatta. And then a wall clock. The old string art. Wow. You will find out. Hey, looks like I'm sitting next to royalty here, but. <clears throat> that really um chill. <laughs> you try to act like I'm cool, but on the inside I'm dancing. <laughs> <laughs> so, how long have you been doing this? Three years. Three years? Yeah. Why would. Why, what? What motivated you to start? I graduated in 2018, mm. but apparently the course I did mm -hmm. doesn't suit my everyday lifestyle. What did you do? 
land administration. We do I even know what that entails. It's, 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 it, it includes the transfer of title leads, who's a mashamba evaluation, oh. yeah, property management. And then you uh, for how long? Five years. And you dropped it? Yes. Why? Because it, it makes you sit in an office from 8 to 5 p.m., uh. sitting in one space doing the same thing every day uh -huh. which was kind of boring so <laughs> because because i like moving around a lot mm. and i don't like wearing official clothes yes so i was just pushed to the corner and then said now what but you're good at this thanks i wouldn't be happy yes so I think it's more important. But yeah. Does it make money? Yes. You live off this. I can live. You can it. now what you do. Uh, currently, because I haven't been doing a lot of it, oh. I've been doing more of the fashion side. Oh. But last year, the whole during the Corona time, this is what I survived on. Oh. Okay. Yes. Then I think me and me and me me and you can do if you ask me. I'll tell you to do this full time because you're really good at this. I will. But then again. I think I'd like to see you on a runway here. <laughs> so, I, so I can compare and contrast and see what. <laughs> Which one is on the top? Yeah. Trust me, it's art. It's art, eh? Yeah. But judging from these, hmm. I think you're, you're, you're yeah, really in the It's not perfect. hard. How many paintings have you done so far? Yeah, I've never counted. Because, like the whole of last year. Yes. Like literally, milk wana kitu naito a Black Friday sale. So uh -huh. it was like Chebs, uh -huh. uh, Black Friday sale. So what I usually do is between mm. Monday and Thursday, yes. I should have done uh, be done with ten paintings. Mm. Ten in one week, because Friday I'm supposed to do the Black Friday wow. sale. So really, I couldn't count. Because oh. like every week I must have done like ten paintings. Ten, ten, ten. Where? I can't really count. I love Kuna Zengin and Mefanya for charity. The others which I've done for gifts. Let me just find out. Eh, uh, inspiration ya, e passion. Inatoka wapi? Because it's not it's not easy for 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 ten paintings in one week. Unachora. Then the next week you still have to do it again. What keeps you going? <laughs> Last year it's the money. <laughs> So for, <laughs> uh -huh. for this year, I think uh, what actually, let's forget about the cash. Mm. What really pushes me to do mm. art is the outcome. The you see, final the final product. Uh -huh. yes. I need to do more. Like yes. for each and every time you do something, you step forward into the next one. Mm. Like you need to do something mm. new. Yeah. Like for example, a few days ago, I, I challenge, I've never done a 3D wall painting, oh. like directly on the wall. Mm -hmm. So in Kasama, I have never done 3D painting. So in Kasama, let me just try it out. Mm. And it's perfect. You want to see it very soon. Where can you, you want to see it social media? Able to pay for art, mm. at Cheb Arts, oh, at Cheb underscore arts mm. and then for my personal instagram mm. at j pasca j pasca yeah j pasca pasca yes you want to yes pasca yeah okay. pasca with a k not a c oh okay yeah. j pasca and then for for art for I, I think when you go to at j pasca i've like linked all the oh, all your for for fashion for art zikozote apoko bai you have different accounts for everything you do. Yes, I can't mix. Hey, isn't it hard to juggle? <laughs> it's very hard. Actually, for, for the magazine, I think it's been dormant for like a month. Oh. Employ some of us. <laughs> hey, are you a good social media guru? Manager, yeah. yes. <laughs> Find Cheb and then just hmm? do your thing. Womba, womba, to my application. Yeah, to my CV. She pays well. I'm going to drive V8, so the money is... <laughs> Like any punishment, can you draw? You have to pass the test. Ah, all they know is how to how to handle social media. No, they have to know how to do that. Yeah. Pole ni watu angu. Pia mi nilikuwa na plan venye nita apply lakini ni mkana. 
that chapter is going to be Who do you look up to? Inspiration Milan. Fabiano Milan. <laughs> of course. <laughs> yeah, because he does like very nice realism artworks. Like, okay, on it looks like a picture, like picture mm. image and looks like a real person. True. Yeah, so that's where I'm headed. I want to be a very good hyper-realistic artist. Oh, okay. I mean, I enjoy your head in the, the, in the perfect direction because you know what I'm And so, when I look up to him, yes. are you mentoring anyone? Yes. Who? Our kids. The kids hmm. that I train. Oh, okay. Um, like in our little Miss Universe or East Africa, mm. we have a category whereby you have to be an artist. Ah, not an artist. We group into your talent. Mm -hmm. Are you an artist? Can you sing? Can you dance? Mm -hmm. So for those who do art, we have like sessions. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because recently we had a kids art day, mm -hmm. and we had like 18 kids. And trust wow. me, go back to Chef Arts. When it's a poor, yeah. Let me see. Yeah, I have to check. And that. kids' imaginations are wild. When you're talking of kids, how old are you? Four to seventeen years. Four to seventeen. Into your four years, and a children. See, I'm not paint. Yeah. That I can take a jina, I can show you. Show you. Yeah, I but it's good to start training kids when they're still young. I think that's why I enroll in Toto Angu. <laughs> okay. I will enroll my daughter. Please do as fast as possible. Yes. Labda, can... labda sa izi amelalia talents. Maze, ni mo na kapashon kani leke uko. Yeah, yeah. Speaking she of does... parenting, do owe umu owe mefanya five years. We go through a five year course. Mm -hmm. Then we can be a mzazi. <clears throat> This is not what I wanted to do. What was the initial reaction? And how has it been from there to this is how we're doing it? Of course, life. an African woman will, uh, or an <laughs> African parent will always ask you, mm. uh, like you need to, to look for a job all the time. Mm. Look for a job. Like, I don't easy with a job. But uh, their initial reaction was not that bad because. Uh, we did a, uh, that time I'd painted uh, President Uru and uh, what do you call Jomo Kenyatta. So, mm -hmm. while you're on AMC, hello, you can do this. Yes. <laughs> so that's when they changed their mind and say, okay, you can do art because mm -hmm. it looks really perfect. Mm -hmm. But up to now, not up to now, up to last year, they were still asking me, um, what a job? Um, what a job? He tried to tell them this is the job I'm doing. Mm -hmm. But as we speak right now, mm -hmm. they do support this more than. And I think I was just how nearly final. Land admin will end up sure. But that, that land administration, mm -hmm. I did well. So it boosted me to do other things. Oh, okay. I went into West. Oh, yeah. at least. <laughs> so. We relax. Tutu wangu wa kiyami niambia nataka kushora na nime kupitisha school fees yote huko. But anyway, I think it's very important for us as parents. As as parents, you encourage your kids to do whatever it is they have a passion for. Because uh, the older they grow, the more realistic vitu zinakuwa. Na kama nafanya kitu napenda, ataishimisha. A happy life kama chenze ni nafanya sa hini. <laughs> But anyway, um, we are going on a short, very short commercial break and when we come back, hey, we are going to torture her. We are going to take her through the, <laughs> the awesome games we play and get to know her better. So please, don't go away.
Welcome back, welcome back Maze. I hope you are kamaji. Say you may refresh coffee because we are going into the fun part. I know you like this part just as much as I do. <laughs> eh, hey, we're going to play a game with an, our awesome guest. As usual, we're going to play Never Have I Ever. <laughs> and today we're going to ask her some some interesting questions so that we find out more about her. Tunjue yeye ni mtoi na gani? Ndio tujue kama tunaleta pasta after the show amombe kama tunafanya aje. Are you ready? No she is. Ready. We like her that way. Is atutaki atutaki ukweli. You want to Wow. Yes. I don't think you can ever be ready for the questions I'm going to throw. Nothing can ever go wrong, you know. Yeah. <laughs> You have clearly never been here with me. <laughs> Haya, let's start. Let's tuanze tu rais. Tuanze rais, ndio. Never have I ever watched porn. I have. Of course you have. <laughs> Wow, okay, how, how can you just start from that? Tell us more details. When was this? Why? What, why did you do this? Why? Why am still a mzuri wa kanisa? I just still a mzuri wa kanisa. <laughs> yes. And it's a curiosity kills the cat, you know. Eh, yeah. curiosity. Okay. Let's forgive you for that. <clears throat> wow. This is eh uh, hey. Cha. Kama maswali nimetumiwa hapa nikuulize. Sijui nikuulize. I'm actually half mm, half sliced right now. No. Yeah. So, question number 2. Never have I ever <laughs> had a one night stand. <laughs> Hi, can someone just walk out of the show? <laughs> no. We have guards there to make sure that you stay. Stay good. I thought I thought it was supposed to be hard question now it's No it's, this apa we just want to find It's you. real we want to know you hiyo tu Ah yeah so hey, go on and as we go on nitaambia tu producer uko nyuma mazee atafute pasta by the time we finish <laughs> No can we, can we can we just do something different <laughs> No <laughs> few more questions say I'm going to take it <laughs> Don't ever trust. <laughs> Someone on the other chair. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so. Question number three. Okay. Never have I ever dated my friend's ex. Never. Never. Mm-hmm. Girl code gama ni. Stick to the code. Kama tu hako anaweza. Sasa tu kweli tu. Hako anaweza. Hakuwa mali safi. Mali safi. <laughs> Never have I ever dated more than two people at the same time. I have. It's Nairobi. Are you dating currently? No. Why? I'm dating my art you know. Really? Yes. Kama tu. Ah ah. No yo, was tena squeezy you are very high standards. You are very high standards. I cannot let someone who is not driving a Range Rover sport. A Range Rover. So you stay single forever until you get to 30, then you get to 40 and you realize, hey, hey. I'm hey. Una rudi. Stay to stop being picky. <laughs> you go back to that guy. Manze, <laughs> that guy you said no to. So, hey. Mm-hmm. Hey. Fine. But at least those things that you were talking about, they're just in the past. You know, the past doesn't matter. Really? Yes. Are you sure? The past doesn't matter. Doesn't matter as much. Okay. Let's let's watch it to assume for now to eh uh, <laughs> Never have I ever gone on a date with the intention of not paying the bill. Never. Unabewanga wallet yako. No, I usually carry my extra cash just in case things go sideways. <laughs> <laughs> Never have I ever failed to show up on a date. Mm. 
umemwambia tunakuja. Alafu kosa kisho hapa. You're in bed, relaxed, watching a movie. With no intention of going. I think I have. Of course you have. <laughs> <laughs> so why did you even ask me then? <laughs> Because I know. So far, I may get the information and I know the kind of eh haki jamii. Allah. Eh, now see someone is calling me. Kojeni maze show inji. Kojeni show inji. Let's roast her first. Aya, one more. Never have I ever gone on a date just to make someone jealous. You have. Is that yeah. person looking? What? Is he around or no, like he'll take photos? No, it's one way or another. Oh, she. Oh. You find out one way or another and you know it. So you're going on this. How will they so how will they find out? A friend of a friend will tell a friend of a friend who will tell a friend of a friend. I never, I've never done that intention. Is not. Mm-hmm. Apparently she can be nice. <laughs> 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 Alright, let's move on. 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 Let's
next time make sure you do more <laughs> yeah invite invite us to your workshop we have to check out kazi yake sindio you guys want to see her in action sindio so make sure maze next time you you doing doing something new to alike will come tutakuja na chai na nini nini na tukunywa hapo tukiwatch uki paint i have a question <laughs> i have a question for him ready yes never have i ever ah, you really know <laughs> been late <laughs> so guys i was only 5 minutes late and <laughs> she has not let me rest ever since 5 minutes that i think is like 4.3 but she won't let me rest but anyway it's okay <clears throat> i'll buy her lunch for being late but for now i want her to be the one to close the show <clears throat> so and the little camera no ufunge issue Hi uh, so guys thank you for joining us today uh with my fellow co-host. Oh. <laughs> so it was an amazing show and I'm looking forward to more and more. So make sure you stay tuned, make sure you watch through and for the next one that's coming up, make sure you watch. Thank you and tourists. <laughs>